Hello everyone, it is day 21 of the Ultimate Reset. We have just finished our lunch, so we have snack and dinner left, and then number, our day 21 will be complete, and our Ultimate Reset journey will be over. Um, I'd say overall, it was an absolute wonderful experience. Um, I would, last week though, I, if you would have, if you would have asked me last week, I would have not said that. I'll be honest with you. What do you think? Same. Yeah. Last week was rough. The crazy thing is, is we didn't, I didn't personally see it as being rough until I got to this week and I yeah. saw such a difference in my mood and my, um, energy, my energy. Oh, energy, especially. Mm -hmm. I was exhausted last week. I was honestly Almost. thinking, is this even worth it? I, I honestly was thinking that last week. And I was wondering if I was getting enough calories for mm -hmm. my body to, because I was just so tired. Tell me about your experience last week. Just tired, not wanting to do something. Or if I did things, I'd have to sit and rest. Mm -hmm. And um, I, at one point, I really wondered, am I getting enough calories? Right. You know, but yeah. what a difference this week has oh made. Oh my gosh, this week is intense. And we realized it, obviously, last week was called... It was called. Was it called detox? I don't know what it was called. Yeah, it was detox. It was detox. Well, we had to we drink this detox. And you saw our videos. It was that stuff in the glass, which honestly, that stuff tasted great. I thought it was good, mm -hmm. um, but it really was detoxing our bodies. And I was, I was not in a bad mood. I was just not. I was just in a blah mood the in, the entire week. But like I said, I didn't notice it. I didn't notice it. My, my family probably did, but I didn't notice it until this week when I saw such my spirits were much better and I have a lot more energy. I mean, I cleaned half the house yesterday in like an hour. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, woohoo, let's go. Um, it's just, it's been that way. So if you ask me now, let me ask you, was it worth it? Absolutely. Absolutely. Awesome. I would say that. I feel clean inside and out. Right. Going to church helps. Yes, it does. Um, also, tell them, um, tell them a little bit about the results you're seeing. Well, I've lost over 15 pounds. Um, I can tell a difference in my face and in my body um, mass. Um, I have hope that I can lose this weight where for years I didn't feel that I could. I, I tried and I failed and I tried and I failed over and over. And this time I really feel like I have the tools and the wherewithal to get it done. And I know you can do it. I'm going to do it. I know. It. She's going to do it. I'm going to do She's it. She's going to do it. I'm and we're going to help her through it, guys. We're going to help her through every step. I have learned a ton for a lot of different reasons than, than why you have. I, I had no weight to lose, um, but my body obviously needed cleansing. Um, and throughout the reset, I wasn't sure I was feeling any different with energy or, or anything like that. Let me adjust this a little bit. Um, but what I did notice, I, I do this week now notice a difference, but throughout, throughout the reset process for me, um, I've taught, I've learned again how to discipline myself with my nutrition. Um, my very first experience with fitness was P90X in 2009, and I did the entire 90 days without cheating, without going over my calories, without anything. You know, I was, I was literally to the T, I was perfect. And I haven't been that way since. And it's now 2013, almost the end of the year. And, um, and that was the beginning of 2009, that was February. So it's been that long since I've disciplined myself the way that I disciplined myself with this reset. So it taught me that I'm capable of doing that again because I honestly doubted myself that I was not able to, to do that ever again. And so it's retaught me how to how to use foods and how to use spices and, and the things that I can do to make foods better for me without reaching for the, for the not so good things um, with, you know, with my calorie intake and stuff like that. And it's also taught me how to cook. I have never been the greatest cook, uh, but over these 21 days, the meals that I've prepared or that we've prepared have been like gourmet, wouldn't you say? Oh, I absolutely. mean, they were amazing and they were simple and it made cooking fun and I'll be honest, I have three things that I cannot stand to do. that shop, cook, and read. But now cooking is not, it's no longer on the top of my I hate to do this list. So um, I'm very grateful for that. I'm very well, grateful for that. It was a refresher course for me <laughs> because I had really quit cooking. And Ray and I 
Yeah. Her husband is named Ray also. And we would grab food out. You know, you're out shopping and we'll grab a fast food or go to a restaurant and weren't eating the best. So I learned a lot too. I learned about some foods I'd never even heard of. Quinoa, quinoa, quinoa stuff like that. Yep. And, nori. Yes, nori. <laughs> and, um, and, and I did learn some things with um, preparing things that I didn't know with the different dishes. And the mixture of things. Oh, I know. It was amazing. I mean, there were foods in the, in these that we were just like, heck no, you know, I can't like nori, yeah. nori sheets, gross. I mean, alone, I'm sure is disgusting. Seaweed, you know, it's seaweed, but it, it taught us to use these amazing foods in ways that we that it enhances the recipes, not that it's just an overpowering dish. You know, it's it's amazing the things well, that the we the mashed chickpeas, yeah, the nori mm. with the nori, but the nori with, you added gamasio. lemon juice and garlic, mm -hmm. and that made all. And you the topped it with nori gas gamasio, gamasio. Mm -hmm. That's not what I called it. But. I know. <laughs> it's called she, nori guacamole. Nori guacamole. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I called it, but it's nori gamasio, I believe. Anyways, so overall, I think I think we would both agree that this reset actually, truly was a, a reset in many ways. Internally, yes. Externally, yes. And just mentally, I mean, it's really been a refresher. It's, it's, yeah. it's, I am so glad that I did this. And I'm so glad that I stuck with it to the end because last week it would have been a totally different story. Yeah. Last week would have been. So I was struggling last week. Yes, it was rough. We had each other though. Mm -hmm. And we had the support of, of our team. We had a, a challenge group put together. Um, my team craved the burn. I had some coaches and clients that were doing it with me. You know, my mother-in-law here, and just you know, my family supported me too. So it was just, it was just great. Great. My experience. husband's been behind me a hundred percent, and it's gonna help when I go home because mm -hmm. he could be a junk food junkie. <laughs> he likes. His we're gonna coats. try, and, <laughs> Ray. We're gonna try and change you one piece of food at a time. <laughs> Those little powdered donuts that you like so much. <laughs> All right. Anyways, well, thank you guys so much for listening. Thank you for supporting us along our journey. It's been an amazing one. I highly recommend the reset, um, especially for people that need to be disciplined, for people that have health issues that need um, cleansing. This this is going to work. It's going to do it for you. Um, and uh, just, you know, as an experience for me, an amazing experience. So for me, too. Thank you guys so much for listening and have a wonderful day. Bye. Bye.